Good day to you all. In this video we are going to watch at the earth ground currents um, what is happening when we uh, earth ground a static charge as we can see over there in that capacitor. So I have an NST that is giving me high voltage and it is one wire connected to this Avramenko plug for charging up this capacitor. Now for the highest voltage to be possible on the capacitor I need to earth ground it while I do the um, charging. So I will connect my earth ground connection. I will charge up the capacitor. It's still a little bit charged from before. It's connected. I cannot hold my meter there for long because it will discharge the capacitor too much. But as you can see, we have over 1000 volts at the moment. So, uh, when I now run the scope for single, then we see that we have some earth ground at the moment that I touch. And then we don't see a response anymore, but the moment I change my earth ground to the other side, we have a spike. And that spike will go lower and lower every time I repeat. But the capacitor is still charged to that high voltage. So when is the changing coming? That is the moment when I switch plate. When I now touch that plate, you see that heavy response over there. Again, when I keep repeating, you see that the value will go lower. So what I need to do I is to change plate from plate to plate. And then I get the most response out of the earth ground. As we can measure again the voltage, we see it's still over 1000 volts. So I will pause the video and I'm going to connect an SCR so that we are that you can see that we are able to switch with SCR in the circuit that I have. So in this part of the video I'm going to show you uh, this circuit over here. So I have the NST that is giving me high voltage to build up a charge in this capacitor. But while I'm doing the earth ground testing this NST is not switched on. So that if is that you must keep in mind. It is a static charge that we are experimenting with. Over here you have the diodes and you can see that in principle the SCR should not be able to do switching because it's on the negative side of that capacitor and also this diode is in uh, opposite polarity uh, so it's in blocking mode for the capacitor charge. But we will see that we are able to get that earth ground current. Over here uh, we have the batteries, so that is that part over here, and that is to switch the SCR over here. So the diodes that we have over here uh, in this part are this one over here. So this is the plus and that is the minus. And the SCR is over here and this is the gate of that SCR and I'm going to connect that red wire to there uh, to make the SCR switch and then we can see that it is possible to have a controlled uh, earth grounding. So the capacitor was discharged before I make my connections for safety reasons. Uh, as you can see voltage is zero. So I need to first start up and charge that capacitor. So we are going to look that we have enough voltage. Oh, oh I have to make my earth ground connection because otherwise it will not go to the higher voltage. Disconnect. Measuring. So now we can see we have 900 volts. Going to connect the earth ground connection over here. 
and now uh, when I switch with the gate we can see that we still have that high response And more importantly, it gives the same value. As you can see, the maximum and low value are still the same. But I'm now do, doing it electronically. So this is an experiment that is still under development. So I need to do some uh, pulsing of this signal to see what is possible there. Um, now, the maximum time that I have at this moment is uh, 56 nanoseconds. So it is not a long pulse. It would mean that if I would have a more current, uh, stable current, I need to go to uh, 17, around 17 megahertz to keep the uh, current very high. Of course, we can work with uh, LC tank circuits and so on, but this is just a video to show you the basics. Uh, and how it is possible to switch with an SCR the earth grounding because this is the best result that I have uh, in all my experiment with earth grounding and switching with SCR. Thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next video.